start again. It's uh, it's freezing cold, absolutely freezing cold. I haven't been feeling very well the last couple of days, uh, but I thought I'd get out today. I took a day off work. It's a Friday. Sun's in my eyes at the minute. Uh, but yeah, I'm up on just parked at Kerber or Kerber Car Park, not the Kerber Edge. Kerber Edge there. I'm just walking on along this edge towards Froggart, and I'm going to do a, a circular walk about six miles. So I'm going to walk, walk along um, Froggart, drop down, climb back up onto um, I think it's White Edge, and link my way back. So like I said, it's about six miles. So yeah, I'll speak to you later. Absolutely stunning day. back that last section I just did there absolutely beautiful I think with the Sun out nice crisp cold day morning I love them type of mornings colder the better for me when it's nice and dry it's a different different kettle of fish when it's uh, raining it gets a bit miserable but when it's like this today it's absolutely stunning so uh, I think I mentioned a little bit further back there that I've been suffering with one of these colds. So uh, I think I had a bit of man flu the morning. I had shakes, sweats, horrible. Uh, I nearly didn't come out today. But um, I took this day off today from work, especially to come out walking. It's not been out much. So I'm, uh, I'm glad I did because it sorted me right out, the fresh air. So, uh, yeah, feeling me a million dollars. So, uh, so glad I come out. It's all, it's good for the head, isn't it? It's good for the old mental state. So, yeah, I'm loving this. It's absolutely brilliant. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to carry on.
this walk so far, even though I'm breathing out my arse, it's fairly steady. Just that short bit there from from the grass in, come across the farm, it's short and steep. I'm just about to get up to White Edge now. So that's the only bit, really. It's a really steady walk, I really recommend it. I mean, I'm only halfway through, but it's a uh, frog at edge, dead steady, dead flat. Uh, you start off quite high up as well at the Kirby, uh, Kirby Road car park, I think it is. Uh, and you drop down a bit, and then it's just that little bit of a um, uphill bit. I'm probably not advertising it very well, but uh, yeah, it's steady, good underfoot, a bit undulating, which you'd expect from around these parts. But I've never been on this bit, I've never been to uh, White Edge, so we'll see what, what this is going to bring. But I'll just spin you around, you can see, hopefully, what I'm seeing. So, the first thing is, I need to do is to find a bit of shelter if we can get some. Brew on because I'm parched. I'm ready for a drink. So I'll, uh, I'll bring you back when I, when I find somewhere. I'll speak to you in a bit. Oh, my God, it's freezing. I found somewhere to, to make a brew. Um, walking along that ridge, it was uh, dead windy. I couldn't find anywhere sheltered, so I've I found this trig point and I've just come off the top of this trig point and found this rock so I'm going to hunker, hunker down behind this rock and make a brew. First things first, get some warm gear on. Bloody freezing. Well yeah, like I said back there, this, this walk is a, a really nice walk. Um, <laughs> Fully recommend it, but yeah, I just, uh, just spotted some deer. You probably can't see them. You might know, but you can't see them. Let's see if we can zoom in. So I've got my brew on. Um, it's struggling a bit because it's cold. On the stove, but it's, it's getting there. It's um, hopefully clear. Get me a hot drink. Well, yeah, that stove I've got. Um, it's called a Soto Amicus, I think. It's brilliant. It's absolutely awesome little stove. I bought it during lockdown, I think. Yeah, I bought it during lockdown, like everything else you do. Um, but it's a really good stove. I think I got this uh, the, the stove and the the cup cooking pot for about 45 quid but yeah really recommend it really good lightweight stove and it all packs down all packs down into that into that and then it's uh, yeah all packs away in a little day sack it's brilliant take it everywhere everywhere with me can't can't fault it oh well it's cold now i'm glad i stopped with that coffee kind of wish i hadn't done that because yeah fingers got cold and uh, when your fingers get cold you can't you stop being able to do stuff well, I'm struggling to fa uh, fasten up the bloody belt on my, uh, on my day side but I'll soon warm back up again you know uh, soon get moving but yeah it's been a, it's been a really awesome walk um, I think I've mentioned back there I strongly recommend this walk uh, I'll try and uh, I'm trying to put the link down in the description. I got it off the uh, Google Maps, so it's on there so I can find it. But uh, yeah, it's probably So, if you're from around the park, but, yeah, like I said, it's what, six miles, I think, about the time I've done. Nice and steady. This will be. As nice as it is today, okay. see where, I'm, where I am. But anyway, I'm waffling now because I'm freezing cold. I might bring it back later. If not, um, consider subscribing to my channel um, and hit the like button. 
met a few few of you just recently have uh, commented as well. I don't know who you are, but thanks for your comments. It means a lot, it really does. Uh, yeah, put a comment there. I'll have to read them. Anyway, um, I'm going to leave it there now, and I'll uh, see you on the next one. Thank you very much. Bye. Thank you.